broken my heart so many times I stopped keeping track Talk myself in Actually, that you cannot get thirsty dude gear yet. Actually, we call them our TG guys. You can get thirsty girl gear, which I should have worn my thirsty girl shirt. Darn it. And my hat. Um, we have beautiful thirsty girl hats that say thirsty girl, and on the back they say I don't spit. So, you you know, you get it. <laughs> I do spit before five, as I would say. But, um, so you can go to beathirstygirl.com, and you can get our great thirsty girl gear. But um, we, we're, we're coming up with our TG guys. The TG guys? Yeah. Okay. But okay. I can't keep the thirsty girl I don't spit hats and shirts in stock. Oh, I bet not. <laughs> I bet. I bet they fly. They're flying out the door. I love it. It's crazy. Well, it, it, it's catchy. They like that. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to move you on to the All next right. line. So I am going to... Where Do I have another glass? Or? Um, yeah. Would you... Hey, Ron, would you grab me another glass, I'll please? just jump out of this. You want Can to, I okay. jump in that yeah. one? Yep. Can I yep. jump in that? Is yep. that like a flower pot or something? Yeah, that I've well, jumped we into? put flowers in it and okay. they grow really Good. nice. They grow well. So this is uh, Russian Thank River you. fruit from Gann Family Cellars, 2007 Russian River. Um, uh, Beautiful. Yeah, all all estate fruit, uh, uh, barrel fermented for about 14. Very months. rich, I mean, a very rich kind of nose. Older vines, they're 30 uh -huh. year old uh, vines. What vintage is this? That's 2007. 2007. Oh, Great yeah. price point, $25. Yeah, this is, you know, it's got again that kind of um, creamy note to it with, mm -hmm. with kind of ripe pear, but because it's Russian River, there's vibrancy on the palate. Yeah. Yeah. And we had a nice barbecue in that vineyard too, it was really wonderful. You'd it's really please, you know, Chardonnay, and I'm a Chardonnay lover. Mm -hmm. I'll just say it right out. Uh -huh. The whole anything but Chardonnay mm -hmm. movement, forget it. I mean, again, if you're if if you don't like Chardonnay, it's because you're not drinking the right Chardonnay. There's a Chardonnay out there for everybody. Well, and, and don't you think part of it is is what you have with that, with that Absolutely. Chardonnay? Absolutely. But again, if you're saying, you know, the, certainly, you know, five, six, eight years ago, there were too many Chardonnays being made in this fat, big, buttery, no character style. Um, and I think people have really scaled back and said, like this wine, we'll give you some of that character that you can get right. from, a, from a creamy Chardonnay that people like, but you've got to have acid. You've got right. to have that freshness. Yeah. Otherwise, why drink wine, yeah. right? I actually call acid the bra of the wine world. <laughs> because, now, because it lifts and separates and makes everything look perky. <laughs> See? That's the goal of acid. You're going to remember that now, right? I will See? never forget. You'll remember that. So I will this never is, forget. This is kind of a nice, it, a little soft acidity on this. This is a nice 36, you know, B or something. But, <laughs> but you know, you get a nice Sauvignon Blanc or something, or Gruder Beltley Lane, or you have 38 double D territory. You're like, <laughs> you know, big, high acid power. <laughs> wow, you guys got to remember that. You have to I use that in the tasting room. now. I'm pretty you sure he's blushing. <laughs> You guys have to use that in the tasting room. Acidity, the bra of the wine world. Yep. Again, I, it does, I mean, that's what it does. It, it makes everything go like this. And that's why we drink wine, though. It's because it, it wakes because up our bra? palate. Oh. <laughs> well, no, drinking no. too much, drinking too much oh. wine makes you take off your bra. So we don't.